guys, this is my Oliver Folklore Christmas cosplay. I have my hat from um, Blue 21 that TJ got me. This is a bandana I've used before for Italy Italia cosplay. It was a scarf that um, I ripped, but because I ripped, all these strings are coming out now and it's kind of like weird now because of the thing. So I use it as like a band drop, but it's actually a scarf. And in the past, I used a surrender flag for Italy. So uh, that was before they banned flags. So um, that was when I was in high school in 2013. And I also was cosplaying him in 2013. And I cosplayed him in uh, 2014 for a meetup. And then 2015, I was going as Femme Italy. It's kind of cool. I feel like it's, it's I don't know. I, I feel like the main character is slightly more known. But I don't know. I love Italia. I think Italia is actually one of the more, um, I don't know about other communities, but I feel like that one's a very welcoming community. So, um, or I mean, that's how I remember it when I was like, when I was starting out with cosplay. Some of the other communities were tougher to get into. Um, and not just like someone from like, who's shy, who's like kind of like nervous, but also didn't live, um, like, I live in a small town, so it's, like, finding cosplayers is a little more complicated. Unless they went to your high school, then it was, like, so much easier. Uh, yeah, so the hat. The wig is actually my big wind-up wig. I just haven't gone as him in a while. Um, and my hair's, like, showing through. And I did my makeup. I'm gonna wash my hair. Um, because I hate every time I... The only thing is, like, every time I cosplay or wear wigs, um, it ruins my... I also get this gnarly, like, wig um, line, uh, wig cap line. I always get that. Um, yeah, so it kind of, like, dries up my hair. Uh, so, I wash my hair now. <laughs> but it's okay, because I was going to do it anyways, so. Um, and I, my, like, contour is pretty terrible. It's the same contour I've done for Italy and the same contour I've done for Peter Pan. So, it's not the best, obviously. <laughs> But that's what we fix with lighting. <laughs> so, um, it looks like I just, like, smudged makeup on my face. Because my contour brush was downstairs, but I haven't contoured in a very long time. Just because I stopped. I don't wear makeup as much just because I, I commute and I don't have time in the morning. Um, I only have time for my eyes and, like, for lip colors. That's really it. So, and this shirt is, if you're wondering, it's from Shaps. Bear in mind the um, pin, which probably is really hard to see. It's a vintage penguin pin. So I really like it. And then the shirt is from Fireball, which is a stay chill. Because Oliver's color is usually blue. But I don't have like a blue jacket. I mean, I do. It's like a blazer. But like, I don't know. I don't know if it would work for the character. It just wouldn't seem as like Christmassy. I don't know. I, I keep associating plaid with Christmas, but I also just really like plaid, so. The, um, the other cosplays I'm going to be working on, uh, the other ones I'm going to be working on are, if anyone saw my video, I was trying to make a video to make it easier to know, like, what I'm going to be going with. So we have Winter Elf Soccer Card Capture. I have my Subasa Reservoir Chronicles wig. That's why I was going to go as her. Not many people know about Subasa Reservoir Chronicles, just one of my favorites. Um, uh, and that's, like, for a narrative. How they, have, how they go about with the artist. And if you know, she's connected to Sakura Cardcaptor if you uh, go into the series. Uh, there's also Christmas Sakura Cardcaptor. So I want to get those ones done today. I have a party night and uh, I have to get ready. So I'm going to wash my hair and then like probably prep into sock. I mean, it's going to ruin my hair all over again. But I have to wash my hair anyways. Uh, again, uh, tomorrow, so, yeah. Um, and there's our, we have Winter Oliver Vocalord, as I just did. He also looks like he'd be out working on the Polar Express, like, at the top of the cart. I didn't mean for it to look like that. It's just my, like, it's just what I, I'm using what I have, so it's a closet cosplay. Uh, which I gave a lot of credit to a lot of cosplay, co uh, closet cosplayers, because it can be tough to afford cosplay. And especially on the holidays when you're buying gifts for people that you love that you don't want, like, I don't know, like, I don't really spend money on cosplay on the holidays. I'd rather spend it on people. Uh, so that's just, like, you know, that's just me. And I, I barely go.
go, I, I rarely cosplay anymore because I don't, no, there's no events where I live unless my friends are already grown out of it or they're doing different things. Or the ones that do do it um, live in Boston, so I'm way far away. <laughs> um, but that's what we have YouTube and TikTok for. So that's the fun part. And now that the semester's over, I can cosplay more. Um, which I, I like doing that, and I like making characters. Um, I think it's really fun to, like, bring them to life and then, like, go into that because, like, I don't, I'm not in theater anymore, so this is, like, my outlet. This is, like, the fill-in for the all the theater feelings that I want. <laughs> like, no, that doesn't make sense. Like, like I really want, I really want to be back in theater, but obviously I'm in college and you know, college first, so this is like fills in that gap. Is what I'm trying to say. It's I'm terrible with words, really, really terrible with words. So, um, yeah, it, this is that, and so the other one is New Year's Luca Vocaloid. Now, she is good for New Year's in different ways. Uh, I feel like. With my other characters, some of them are more, like, younger characters because, um, when I was in high school and, and beginning of college, people kept thinking I was 15 or younger, and, um, yeah, so I didn't really fit the role for many, like, uh, like older characters. Now, at the point that I'm very, like, tired-looking and school has really aged me, <laughs> I feel like I could probably do older characters. I went as her in high school for Magnet. That was really fun the day I did that. Um, so yeah, it's, we have New Year's Luca, so I'm going to be wearing a dress that TJ got me, and I don't know if I'm going to actually wear that on New Year's, it's kind of like a tight dress, so like for that I have to like really be hitting the gym every day, I haven't been doing that, i just been working on my finals every day, so there's always that kind of like, you have to make some sort of sacrifices around finals, and that was like my diet going out the window for a few days. That's okay, I can work back on it. The other one is Winter Elf Rem from ReZero. Uh, she's really cute. I like that she can fight. I like that when a lot of characters can do it. When like a female character is like super cute, but she's like she could like take down like a whole bunch of like villains. Like I think that's really cool. Uh, I think we need more. I, I mean, there's probably a lot of characters like that out there, but yeah. Or if she's like <laughs> she's kind of like Taiga, where she's like. I don't know. The Sinjaris are very, very interesting, very cute at times, but, like, they're strong, you know, don't piss one off. And the other one is, uh, this makeup is so much itchy. <laughs> As I know, I haven't contoured my nose, I never contour my nose, I hate, part, part, part of me hates my nose, and the other part of me dislikes, it's like, oh, it's part of where my family is from, and, like, my, all my aunts have it, but I feel like it just makes people look at me funny. Um... So we have Winter Elf Rem, so that'll be fun. For her, I'm working on, like, what I'm going to wear for her, like, for her character, because I have a red dress, which I haven't worn yet. It's cute, it has pockets. I don't have any Christmas dresses. I used to, but I'm not a kid anymore. And I don't usually wear red. It's not really in my character. I only wear red around Valentine's Day or Christmas. Um, unless I'm wearing my red plant, like my red flannel, then that's different. But like, or like my dark, like auburn. Um, I have some dark auburn. When I wear, it, I feel like it kind of reminds me of like the Gryffindor colors. Um, yeah. So, and I'm probably gonna wear the red dress and maybe my taiga sweater. So, there's that. And we also have Christmas. Yes, that's Christmas elf for winter elf. I would say me and my jacket, like, just because, like, any winter clothes I think is pretty good. And then we have Winter Elf Yui Kudai. I haven't seen anyone go with her. I definitely want to go with her because I have the wig. Not for specifically her. It was for a different character. But I might as well go as her because, like, why not if you have a wig? I already went as, um, I already went as Ochako <laughs> from My Hero Academia. I already went as her. And it wasn't, like, that popular. And, um... I don't know if maybe that's just, like, I don't know enough people, or I don't know if she's, like, she may not be, like, a favorite of people. I don't know. I think she's really cool. I feel like all the characters are really cool. Here's how I see it. I see it as if I have the wig for the character, I'll go as you. If I don't have the wig for the character, I can't go as you. And I can't do much with my hair because, like, I don't want to do anything drastic. Uh, yeah, so... 
um, not drastic in a bad way. I just, I have a hair condition, so I have to, like, really take care of my hair. So if I was to dye it, I think I'd be more nervous out of my mind about changing the hair texture when my hair texture's already been changed. And that wasn't my fault. That was my health. Mm, health isn't fun. Anyways, yeah, so I, I'm thinking to get a haircut. I really, really have been wanting to get a haircut. So, like, after New Year's, or I'm hoping before New Year's, I really want to get a haircut. My hair is getting long. I mean, it, at times I feel pretty, and at times I feel like I just want a haircut. It's like, it's just easier to manage when it's slightly shorter. Uh, hair feels like pretty long right now. This is like where it's at. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not Southern, sorry. Um, this is where my hair is at the moment, and I kind of want it like right here. I don't know how it's going to look. Usually when I get my hair shorter, I look like a kid. But when my hair is longer, it gets staticky and it gets tangled. And I feel like it's weighing down. Like, I want to bring volume back into it. And I switched my shampoo. So, yeah, I feel like maybe if it's shorter, it'll help. And because we're going to be going into the Roaring Twenties. Here's the thing. I, I'm split between the Roaring Twenties is, like, great Gatsby clothes. But then I found out from Mad Molly on TikTok. Uh, but the Roaring Twenties, and it's like, oh, that sounds really cool. So, um, and that's more of like uh, bringing seeing fashion back into um, into things, and I think that is really cool. I like the play on play word of words. So then the fear is if I cut my hair, how am I going to do that? I, my extensions aren't the best. Um, they actually rip my hair out, so I could use extensions. It's just. I think I would only use them for the TikToks. And extensions usually cost a lot of money. So I don't know. I mean, I, I actually, what I could do is uh, instead is wear my No Game No Life wig. Because that one kind of it has like different colors in it. And I think that could look really cute. Anyway. And it's sky blue, which I would love to have sky blue hair. It's just. I just, I can't dry it out more than it's already dried out, and it wasn't even my fault. I don't even straighten my hair or blow dry it. Like, I blow dry it, but that's the most I do to damage it, and not it's not on purpose. It's just if I don't do it in the winter, I get sick, and then when I get sick, I get sick for weeks because of my stupid immune system. So, it's just, ah. Yeah. It's like right now, I feel like at times, if like when I get out of the shower and I blow dry my hair, it feels like I'm covered in split ends. Which a salon lady might say, oh yeah, you are, but then that might be like a good chance for her to like cut my hair, but that's not a good reason, that's not, it's not good. Um, and I can't, I can't go with the layers anymore, because like the layers, I feel like it's just, that's why my hair looks like split ends, covering it everywhere, so. Now I'm going to take off this makeup, I'm going to go pop the shower, and then we will work on my other characters. I am really excited, and I am going to do some makeup looks this morning to uh add to my festive videos i don't know i don't know if i'm gonna do a lot of like i feel like this will probably be the most stuff i do for christmas aside from like the shopping hauls it's just gonna be um uh, me doing shopping hauls and me doing some makeup ideas for my eyes <laughs> that's my eyes and maybe my cheeks that's really it because I can't do much, and I don't want to do much today, cause tonight, because I'm going tonight to a party, and I don't want to overdo it, so I'm not even going to wear any of those uh, looks, because that would be way too much, so I think I'm just going to tone it down, and maybe do like a subtle gold in my eyes, I think that could be really cute, just like warm it up a little bit, and I don't have any under eye, I ran out, and I'd, the one I was using was elf, and it doesn't really do the job anymore, I think my circle's just way too much, so I'm like, if anyone has any ideas, please tell me about there, please.